Hi, my dear students. This is Pratap Reddy, Placement Officer, Gates Institute of Technology. Today, I would like to give you demonstration on how to use Microsoft Portal to learn your uh, certification course, which is enrolled by Apache and JNTU. The first is you need to open a browser, Chrome. Internet Explorer or any available browser and then type the URL so apschedu.sharepoint.com this is the portal you need to log in so when you enter this portal it is asking you to open or type your username now you have to uh, type your username so already this username shared with you so i am taking one of the student user id click on next so then is it ask you enter password you just enter the password which is uh, created then click on sign in button So after login into your account, so this is the home page displayed to each and every student after login into your Microsoft account under SharePoint. So now you just check it out or click on this SharePoint option tab. So when you click this SharePoint tab under this app launcher which is uh, left to top corner here so SharePoint when you click this button it shows the window like this so here in the bottom you just see this learning portal featured links learning portal click on this learning portal So when you click on that learning portal, it is navigating to Andhra Pradesh State Council of Higher Education portal. You just scroll down into, scroll down, so this student is mapped with introduction to java programming this is the course which is mapped so already we are circulated uh, i mean we are given circular from 17th onwards live classes will be commencing for the students who are enrolled for intro to programming using java so your live course links will be displayed in the right side uh, MSc 012 Intro Java Programming using Java 17th to 27th 10 days duration. So morning 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. This is the first link. And the second one is afternoon link 2 to 4 p.m. link. Okay. To attend the live course, you have to click this URL. On 17th it is navigating to live classroom so similarly in the afternoon session 2 to 4 this is the URL you just click this URL it is navigating to your live course of programming Java so this is the process you have to follow to login into the account and attend the live course Java program before that i would like to suggest you 
first you have to click on this intro java programming uh, it is uh, internet is disconnected one second so you just click this course details here you can identify your course entire information so this is introductory video intro webinar click on this intro webinar it displays one video recorded video every student should watch this recorded video it is mandatory you should remember this webinar introductory course for every student the student may be enrolled for java may be enrolled for azure enrolled for python whatever the course is enrolled every student having this introductory video this video must and should every student should watch entire video before starting your actual live class on introduction to so it is a 30 minutes recorded video everyone should log in and complete this video before starting your live session because in this introductory video they are giving you some instructions and inputs which is related to your course so after completion of intro webinar just see live course recordings this is live course recordings so these live course recordings are the recorded videos if you are absent or if you are unable to attend any class on your request recorded sessions will be shared with you so those recorded sessions you could identify in this second option live course recordings and third one is course study material so here they are uploading the material in terms of documents or PDF files. So after completion of the sessions, you can identify the documents, material in terms of PPTs, Word documents, maybe PDFs. And comes into the fourth one FAQs. So after at the ending of your course, they are posting or posting the questions which are frequently getting. Uh, the questions which are uh, frequently identified from the students so this is the usage of learning portal this is common to all irrespective of the enrolled course but live course point of view definitely you have to click on live sessions under under featured link learning portal repeating again you just click learning portal future link it is navigating you into the AP state council of higher education portal just to scroll down and identify the course links so whichever the course is enrolled you just click on the link and start learning Thank you.